and welcome to our channel. I'm Jeffy and this is my best friend Android. He's a Chihuahua, but I found him on the street, so you know, who knows if he's a real Chihuahua or not. Um, so I found these cute little pumpkins at the grocery store and they came in a three pack, so if we mess up, we do have a couple more shots, but I'm hoping to get this in one shot because then we can try and attempt to use the other two pumpkins on dog treats for another video. I think we're gonna have to go outside first and spray a piece of our pumpkin and then we'll get going. So we'll be right back. Ready? Okay. And we are back with a biscuit and a sticky pumpkin. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start pouring the glitter on. Try and get a good even coat. I'm looking at this and it's not anywhere near as black as I was hoping for. So I think we're gonna run outside and um, Put a second coat on this. All right, and we're back. Android, come here. Can I see you? There it goes. All right, so let's try and get the glitter on this before it dries. All this on one plate now. I think the second coat will do wonders. Also, like it said to get the stuff on within 10 minutes of putting the glue on. I did wait a little bit longer before our first coat and I think that might have had a little bit to do with why things weren't sticking quite as well as they normally do. This is already looking a lot better. Oh god. I have glitter all over this room. It's okay though. I want this very coated. I'm just gonna roll it for a while. I don't know if the bowling is helping or hurting. I am feeling relatively confident with how black this looks. Our pumpkin is pretty dry now. Um, I've determined already the side with the most sparkle and have put it towards the camera so you guys can see it. Our next step is going to be attempting some ears. So I'm just gonna try and cut an ear and see how that looks based on memory of my dog. <laughs> Cute pointiness. I got one. I left like an extra centimeter, centimeter and a half of material at the bottom because we're gonna cut little um, triangles into it. That way we can attach them with pins. So here's our two ears, two identical ears, and I believe we're gonna want them on the chihuahua like this, yes. So next, I'm just going to go along the bottom. The middle zigzag is gonna go the opposite direction, and that's what's going to make our ears stand up. Oh, I'm glad we don't need these many of these pins. Oh, I just bent one. There you have it. I, I'm pretty impressed, actually, um, with how those turned. So the next step, this is going to seem ridiculous, but we're just going to do one more quick spray over the front of that Loctite and come back because next we're going to put some glitter on the ears and add some eyeballs. Initially, I was just going to spray the ears for us to glitter the ears, but because we were out there, I figured we would do one more final layer of glitter on the front of our pumpkin. Um, I have this random mix of glitters I got on eBay for a couple bucks. You could really use any glitters. Give me, I have a pumpkin in my hands. Um, and this is just because if you notice on the inside of his ears, it's like, it's not black, it's tan or something. So I'm just gonna drop some of these very carefully on the inside of his ear to add some color. And then I'm going to pour some black glitter over top. So it's not the same as the rest of the pumpkin, but it's also not too crazy on its own. Let's show the camera. And then, um, when I work with glitters, I like to work with a lot of different types of glitter because it just gives me more 3D effects. So this is a black glitter that I just had on hand. It's um, very, very fine, very fine glitter. So I'm going to begin by pouring that on the ear. I'm also going to just pour it on the face. And this fine glitter will really, really help fill in any of those spots that um, the big glitter just didn't get a hold of, you know. 
Um, and the nice thing about fine glitter is it just goes so much farther, so much farther. Um, let's see this whole thing. And then I'm going to go ahead and shake it off. So we can see some of those pretty colors in our ear. And I'm gonna go ahead and let this woo, sit for a second to dry. Clean up our glitter again. I know I have it all over my hands. It's getting a little ridiculous, but we are almost done. We just need to add some eyebrows, a collar, and um, the eye. So our next step for our pumpkin is to do a collar. And to do that, you'll need one piece of foam. Um, I believe this will be long enough to make it around, yes. And then you're also going to need to cut out a small bow tie. All right, there we go. So I'm going to go lock tight these and be right back. So we got our sticky pieces here. All righty. So dump that out onto a plate to make it easier and just dip these in there. All right, so let's see, to get our pumpkin thing on. So annoying when there's danglies like please just stay in your place so we have our collar on and I actually can't see very well from back here so I'm gonna come to the front and try and get this guy on Clean it up a little. Um, I do like that I picked an orange background on this because of the way I dipped it it didn't like make as much of a coating as I wanted so it's nice to have that orange in the background Come to the front. There we go. So now that we have these, I'm going to take a black and we're going to need to do two pupils. All ready to go and we're just going to do a little dot to combine the two all right now that we have eyebrows I'm sorry now that we have eyeballs we're going to need to glue them on um, all right so hopefully these stick well we only have one shot with these which I get so nervous when you're at the end of your project and you get one shot to put something in the right place. So that's where that's going. Okay, I think we did a really nice job on those. And so all we have left is our finishing touch, which is going to be the eyebrows. Um, I didn't glue them, this is just set into place. I don't know, I just, it is spooky, it is Halloween. Let's, let's look at the real dog, see what's going on. Yeah, so, I don't know, I, so that is with eyebrows. And that is without eyebrows. It just, it looks happier. It looks like a happier dog. I think for cuteness purposes, I'm gonna leave it like this. Um, I feel accomplished that we tried the eyebrows. So I got everything cleaned up a little. And I guess it's time for our final thoughts. Um, I'm very happy with how this turned out. I do think it looks a decent amount like Android. We couldn't quite nail the eyebrows without making it look a little too scary for his personal Halloween preference, but I do feel overall that this is a decent replication. I mean, for what we could do with a pumpkin, this is pretty spot on. Let's just, let's see those ears. See that ear? Ear to ear ratio. Let's give them the other ear. Android. There you go. 
Thanks for watching our video. Please like and subscribe to see more.